welcome back to my channel so let's just jump right into your messages and see what's going on with your person let's see why they're distant and cold towards you spirit what messages do you have for libras what do they need to know and that card slid right out to the side so this card slid sideways so some of you may be thinking about talking to this person and they may be thinking about reaching out to you some of you haven't forgiven someone about uh you haven't forgiven them for something they did to you yeah conflict some of you are still wanting to argue or fight with this person um let's see what else comes out here Spirit, what messages do you have for Libra? Why, why is your person distant and cold? Oh, wow. Okay. So all these cards just spit out of the deck. Okay, give me one second. These cards are going everywhere. All right. So somebody, um, they don't feel like you guys can make this work. They may feel like things are too toxic between the two of you. But I feel like the reason why you're holding back from this person. So someone is being stubborn with you. But you're holding back because this person betrayed you. They stabbed you in the back too many times. Could be a Capricorn or some someone where the relationship has gotten really toxic. Every time you try to talk to this person about how you're feeling, there's an argument. Yeah, we have the judgment reversed here. You don't know if you want this anymore. I feel like you tried to be patient with this person. So we have a lot of major arcanas here. So I feel like the universe may be taking over. I do see a change here. So this is good energy, the Wheel of Fortune. Some of you may be dealing with a fixed sign, a Leo, an Aquarius, a Scorpio, or a Taurus for some of you. We also have Sagittarius here. We have double Scorpio with the Judgment card and uh, the Wheel of Fortune. So some of you are definitely dealing with Scorpio. And you may feel like... You have no idea how to make things stable anymore. I feel like you're thinking about when things um, were once good between the two of you wanting to go back there. I feel like you're extremely patient, though. Some of you with the temperance card, you're feeling like, okay, at some point, I know that this is going to balance out. But when? Because this person is not, I don't feel like they're walking away from this. They want to come out of this tower situation that you guys are in. They feel like you guys can be happy again. This is someone who doesn't like to show their emotions. We have the King of Cups reversed. We also have the Sun. So some of you may be dealing with the Leo that wants to come out of a um, tower situation with you. do you have for Libra? What do they need to know about their person? Why is their person holding back? Why is your card sliding all over the place? This person feel like the passion between the two of you is gone. We have the Three of Swords, the Moon, the Five of Cups. Oh, you're waiting for this person to talk or they're waiting for you to talk. I just, the whole reading was just like this on um, Virgo. So some of you may be dealing with the Virgo. You guys had the same four cards in the same placement. The Page of Pentacles. I feel like if this person reaches out to you, you will talk to them. But you're not um you're not going to make this happen. It's like you're feeling like okay, this person keeps hurting you with the 3 of swords here and with the 10 of swords. You're done letting this person um play games and you're done letting them walk all over this connection with the moon card being here you feel like this person has a lot of secrets they're not honest and then they come back towards you like nothing has happened instead of apologizing and making it right and not repeating this is someone who keeps repeating bad actions or bad behavior so this person has a nerve to be holding back they have a nerve to be distant and cold with you now, if, this, if it's the other way around, take it how it's resonating. You know, flip and reverse the roles if... Oh, yeah, some you guys flip and reverse the roles if need be. But um, the world card is here. Some of you have walked away. Or you're saying that it's over. 
with the world, the six of swords, the five of pentacles. But you're still looking back at the situation as if, if this person, okay, so this is how I'm seeing this Libra. You're feeling like if this person doesn't reach out to you to apologize and make things right, you're done with this. I don't feel like you don't love them anymore. I just feel like you're like, I'm, I can't do this anymore. Like, I don't care if I love you or not. Um, I'm not going to let you take advantage of me anymore. We have the King of Pentacles reverse. This is somebody who, when you try to talk to them about something, it's like they know what they're doing, but they're not taking accountability for it. Somebody is not taking accountability for this Three of Cups situation they have going on, this third party situation. I feel like they keep telling you that they're not dealing with someone when you know that they are because they don't make time for you. You may also see it as though this person doesn't do much. They don't take you anywhere. The king of pentacles in reverse, you know, they're not stable. They're not grounded. They may be always looking for a job or they may always have some sort of money issue. And you're like, okay, I'm putting up with a lot here. So you have the audacity to have a third party situation like, what do you have to offer? I feel like whoever you guys are dealing with, if they're dealing with a third party, they accept this bad behavior from them. And you're just like, I'm not going to accept it. So you're telling, you're like telling this person, you can have them. Even though you still love this person, you're like, no, you got it. <laughs> like, you can have them. Like, I'm not putting up with it. And I feel like this person knows that you're feeling this way and it's bothering them because I feel like this is someone who never thought that you would, they would get you to this point. They may have thought that you were always going to be on their side or they will always have you in their life. So even if this person is being distant and cold right now towards you, they're thinking about you. And this is somebody who is going to reach out to you at some point with the nine of cups. Yeah, they're just trying to figure out when Libra, <laughs> the, the queen of swords came right up here. They're just trying to figure out when because the seven of cups is here with the nine of cups. So they still feel like there's something about you that make them happy. But it's hard. It's going to be hard to manifest with this person with the magician reverse because you feel like they're a liar. You can't really trust them. You're tired of wondering if things are going to change. Um, could be with a Pisces for some of you or you just feel like things are stuck and they're always stuck. And you're like, I've waited for so long. Like you may feel like this is just a waste of your time. Some of you are angry with this person. And I feel like they know it and they may be afraid to reach out to you because they know that it's not going to be an easy conversation. And I feel like this is what they're looking for, Libra. They're looking for an easy conversation. Yeah, but they're not going to get that from you. This is somebody who wants a new beginning with the Fool card. They're making you think that they're okay without you, but they're not. They're just being sneaky in their behavior with the Seven of Swords. I also feel like this person is getting attention from someone else, but still waiting to hear from you. And they feel bad about the situation with the nine of wands. I'm sorry, ten of wands. But they're not willing to reach out right now. Because this person is, is sort of afraid of what's going to happen. Like, I just feel like they don't want to hear. They don't want to hear you either curse them out. Or it's something where this person is afraid to talk to you. Because they know, like, the point, the finger is pointed at them. They're the reason why things are the way they are. Yep, the page of wands is reversed here. But look, this is somebody who's still thinking about you. King of wands, nine of swords. Yeah, this is not the energy of someone who doesn't care. This is the energy of someone who's like, oh my God, I know when I reach out to Libra, like they're going to have a mouthful. You know, it's like they're going to curse me out or it's going to be an argument. We're not going to be able to heal the situation with the four of swords. This could be a fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius here. This person may think about you a lot at night when they go to sleep. They may be sleeping right next to somebody else thinking about you. We have the Knight of Cups. Yep, the Seven of Pentacles. They're wondering if you even care about what you guys have together. Is it enough for you to still care about them? Or are you willing to give up on whatever you guys have built together? That's what they're wondering here. See, this person is thinking along the lines of, well, I've been with Libra for this amount of time, that amount of time. I know they're not, not going to just let that go. And that's not fair to you because that's someone who's taking this connection for granted. Because it's not about the time that you guys have spent together. It's about how you're being treated. 
And I feel like this person's not seeing that. So this is somebody who loves you who don't know how to love. They just know that, you know, their feelings that they have for you and that they care about you. But I don't feel like this person knows how to love. And not only that, with the two of swords, there's something here that you you require out of them. But either they're not ready to be that person for you or it, they just don't have their life in order. But still wanting to offer love to you with the Knight of Cups. I feel like this is somebody when you talk to them about where their life is headed, they can't even tell you. Look at this person's face. They don't even know. This may be someone who has goals and dreams, but they don't chase anything. They may talk to you about what they want to do, but they don't make anything happen. So those are the messages that I have for your reading, Libra. Thank you for watching my channel, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.